Hello everyone, how are you? Welcome back to my channel, as Daisy here. Today we're gonna actually do a review for five cushion foundations. Right now, cushion compact is really on the trend. It's huge. So let's start with actually the Lancome today. So the Lancome one, which is actually the second generation, this one is actually quite nice. It's actually give you quite nice coverage. Uh, actually, I will just try them on because later on I will go for all the 10 assets for different ways to compare for the 5 foundation anyway. So let's have a look for applying them on. But personally, I don't really like to use the compact, I mean, the, normally the sponge in the compact. I do find to use the brush is much easier. So let's have a look. Uh, we have after and also before, which is on the right side. And second one, we have the shadow one. So this one here is actually quite new one as well. And it does really give you a really nice hydration as well. I'm covering one of actually my mold here, which is to show you. Yeah, we can have a quick look about the coverage. Plus, now I'm trying on my face. I actually get a really uneven skin tone with my jawline. So you can actually easily see the difference straight away. And my personally just prefer to use a brush, you know. And let's have a look before and after. Now let's move on to Clinique ones. The Cushion uh, Compact for Clinique one is actually... Uh, I think it's actually really nice for you know sensitive skin because they don't add fragrance and also there is you know, allergies tested as well. And we quickly put it on and have a look for how it feels on my skin. Yeah, as I told you, it's really a pure huge difference already. It's brightening up straight away. And also notice the nose as well. It's actually give you quite nice after with the pores. Now we move on to the old one. So this one is actually a new one I just opened it and this one with the sponge is quite different from the I mean the first two. This one is actually quite intense. It's quite dense in there. So now I'm trying on my action mode again just to show you the coverage. And then I'm moving on for my face. So I try to use the same brushes also to show you how the same amount I picked up and with the coverage and also with actually the result on my face as well. Now let's have a look before and after. Cool, move to the next one, which is Estelor the Double Wear Cushion Stick. This one has have a really small applicator in the you know, head, uh, so I'm actually still use my brush would be much faster. Right, after we put it on, let's have a look and see how it looks like. We're gonna actually compare them from the look first. So I guess right now, um, everybody was actually choosing any product is actually also based on how it looks like, isn't it? <laughs> so these are all really beautiful, but it come with a different ways. So first of all, let's have a look for the Lancome. So the Lancome one is actually cut and have like a gold mirror surface and also with a black base. And it's quite nice and the actually gold mirror, sometimes you can use it like for uh, reflection as well and plus I also did actually a Lancome Miracle Cushion I uh, was actually previous video last break about the no makeup makeup look if you're interested in it, please have a look for the video link I mean with the information below now let's move on to uh, Shishado one so it's like a black and white coverage it's quite cool we will say easy is a good look now let's have a look for Clinique this one is a silver mirror surface with a white base the only thing is though, be careful with actually the foundation sometimes get out of the white base. Alright, let's have a look for the old one. So the Forever Perfection Cushion is actually the second generation of that. So this one has come with a navy polished case. It looks quite pretty. Now let's look up to the Estee Lauder Cushion Stick. This one is actually a gold lid with actually clear plastic body. Alright, next we're gonna compare all of them about the tech they use. So let's start with the Lancome one first. The Lancome is actually partnered with actually Polar Cushion Technician. So they is like a tailor made for long wear and coverage. Unlike normal sponge cushion, this ultra absent fiber network was specially created to lock in high coverage textures. So basically you can it feel like it's like you have double kind of like inset in there and when you push them they won't actually spill that. So let's have a look for the shadow now. This one is actually the Emanate Skin Illumination with actually, you know, kind of the responsive sensory technology, which means 
It can give you really nice hydration, plus it can balance the oil and water in the skin as well. Cool, now let's look at the Clinique BB Cushion. So it's called City Block for a reason. It's quite famous for the City Block for the physical sunblock. It's really high SPF and also helps protect against the, actually the environment as well. Now let's have a look for the old one. Forever Perfection is actually L Cushion Technology. Uh, skin here is actually also in this, so it really helps you to give you the skin here result, plus like a cushion compact foundation result as well. It's also the poreless to effect and also skin care essential, helps to rebalance the skin, so as to remind the texture and also nice soften. So oh, let's look at the last one for its loaded double wear cushion stick. This one is actually quite a new creative block because we used to have like the stick foundation. Now it's actually cushion stick foundation, which is quite a nice idea. Basically, you can really use them and to, you know, give you the nice coverage. But this one not really like the double wear normal foundation though. Coverage wise, it's much lighter, but it still gives you a really nice uh, kind of like a glow and also kind of like a really natural finish as well. Also, just like the applicator is actually already on top of you actually, you know, stick. So you can really use it in a nice way to apply it all. So with the tech wise, if we have a review on there, I was looking at yeah, so loader and also shadow and both Lancome and Dior they have quite a nice technology there and now let's have a look for the colors. So for the actually tinted idol uh, cushion company from Lancome, they actually have 18 shades. So you definitely get more chance to match for your own. Shishida one do have five uh, color, and then Clinique one have actually four. And uh, the Dior one have six, and also the cushion stick from Lauder is actually have 17 shades. So you can actually choose either one for you. I'm trying them on my face right now, so you can tell even though they probably come like a similar light to shade but still quite a lot different and here is because I actually read the wrong number the Lancome one I'm using is 110 and the sh uh, shadow is N1 and Clinique Fear uh, is okay but the, actually I found modern Fear is more like a, a pink side and then we get actually uh, the wall, uh, 010 and also Lauder 1 and 2 as well so you can see even though they are kind of like similar light to shade but the actual undertone is quite different and uh, yeah so i guess i would suggest you always just go for the counter to try for you know just a trial to see how the color appear on your skin after this uh, we're gonna moving on to brightening i guess brightening is quite important and because you really want it to look much healthy look and also it depends on like how you feel myself i'm really after brightening so if you look at this the oil and also shadow give quite a nice lift and also the cushion uh, stick does from loaded as well and now we move to actually uh, how you feel about the freshness so I'm having all of them on actually all your control paper. It's like a block paper from Shishido. And normally you can use this one to block the oil on your skin. So I'm tapping them all and then just actually dabbing them on the paper to have a with you. You can tell uh, even all of them said it's oil free, but you can see the Lancome one actually has a lot of the come through. And uh, later on, I'm going to actually use the device to really check for the you know oils as well. Right, let's have a look for the coverage. Even though we know like a cushion is probably not gonna be a full on coverage, but actually Lancome, this one is actually does give you quite nice coverage. It's designed for fuller stroke, but also with coverage. You can tell from my hand, I'm writing with a pen with all the name and then cover with actually match the foundation for the cushion. So Lancome have the most coverage and then comes to it for the rest of the technique and the oil and the loader stick probably have the lighter kind of like a sheer coverage. Now let's have a look for nourishing. I really want something you're always nourishing because for foundation wise, you don't really want them dry and cracking on your skin. So now I have the device actually telling you the first line is about the water, the second line is about actually the oil. And with actually the right lighting, it's actually telling you it's not really the house. So Lancome ones actually get there. And then this one is to show that we have 38% of them. 
water and also 25.5 of the oil there which is okay and then we're gonna move on for connect one So click one that tap 40.7% of actually the water in there and also 27.2 of the oil. It's actually quite nice to control the oil and give you actually the hydration. Now we move to the old one. So it's 42 for the water and also 28 for actually the oil. So it's still quite a happy face. It's a nice one. Now we move to loaded one. So the actual water is 31.7 and the oil is at 47.5. So I guess it really depends on how your skin is and you can find the right you know, one for yourself. So these are for hydration nutrition wise. I do recommend for the oil, snake and also Lancome if you have drier skin. Okay, so we're looking at the finish and the elastic. Uh, I do find like uh, most of them can last in quite long, nicely and uh, Lancome and also Dior probably the most longer lasting one and then Shiseido. Uh, Clinic one is okay as a glow finish and also Lauder one is actually designed for 8 hours. It's still all good. I mean most of the time you only need 8 hours anyway. All right, so we move to actually sun protection wise. So nowadays sun protection is really important, especially where I live in New Zealand. The sun is really strong. So many people get actually, you know, sunburn after they, you know, they expose yourself in the sun. So when you apply your foundation, you always want to maybe adding a little bit like a high SPF on, you know, on the underneath if you do going out a lot. But if you're not, then the actually cushion compact is quite good for you because most of them have quite a nice cover, I mean, sun protection already. So Lancome and the Clinique one have SPF 50, the old one have SPF 30, Shishiro is SPF 25, and the other one don't really have much, you know, with the sun protection. But it's nice for you to enjoy the night. Now let's have a look for uh, the sponge. So that's the last part of comparing. So we started with actually the shishido one. So this one is definitely made in Japan and you can feel the texture is really nice, smooth and also the sponge is quite nice to use. The old one is actually similar kind of texture, it's like a sponge one. Now we move to Lancome, so that's actually quite a different point because this one has actually really made the difference. When you charge it, you can feel quite dolly. Now we move to Clinique one. It's actually similar to actually all the other Japanese kind of protection. And now we move to little ones. So, so this little one actually you can take them off to wash them. All of the sponge definitely you can wash them if you feel like they are dirty. Uh, but I do suggest you guys actually always keep maintaining them. If you like me use a brush that's okay. But if you do use actually the sponge always try to get them nice and clean. Plus I found actually uh, above all the actually companies. Shishido actually sell the actual sponge by itself, so you can buy them individually. If you don't like to wash them, you can just buy a new one for maybe like a $9 or something. So which is quite good. Then I will have a wait, review. Hi, so that's it. So we tried all of the actually the cushions. These are actually quite nice. I would say it's a great idea to try them all together have a week here because then you can figure out I think the most coverage just goes to Lancome and this one because uh, it's also I think it's the third generation of the air cushion so that's actually the only one they actually have doubled in the air so which have a look again so basically these ones can control how many actually you know liquid been popping out instead of sometimes when you open the new one if they don't have like a double kind of like a filter uh, if you're dipping your uh, even sponge or your brush in there sometimes you can dip in too much uh, also about to apply them I found like actually if you are dry skin this one probably the best one for you it has like a high neurotic acid in there so it's help you to keep the hydration all day and also I tried it for another day for 14 hours the long lasting is still quite good it does have a little bit of shine a little bit greasy but because it's quite hydration I think that's why so if you are dry skin that's really good um, but if you are oily skin so this Clinique one would be the go-to for you because Clinique one is actually uh, really nice to control the oil so if you have slightly oily skin these one are actually quite better for you 
the old one I would recommend for people who really like the you know kind of like a hind or the pores or so okay because the texture is after that it's really good and uh, for the loyal one this one here uh, because it's actually a stick so basically it's pretty easy if you actually you know need a little bit of touch up on the go but it's also quite nice for the design because with the stick once you actually use a little bit it comes down so the this part is actually the new one probably gonna be like this so once you use them it become like a you know lower and lower it's kind of an alarm for you you will know when you need a new one because sometimes when the cushion you know comes for the last end you are just still not sure and also another really nice tips for you guys is like once you finish the cushion you can actually try to take the sponge out get another round because sometimes actually the end and uh, the bottom actually the sponge can still suck a little bit the end of the foundation so you can use them as well and uh, compare for all of those I think they all have like a different it really depends how your skin is and how you want your makeup the finish looks like but for actually the cushion comeback normally I don't really use the sponge because I found actually brush which is like a buffer brush it's much easier to apply them I'll show you the brush I will recommend so these kind of brush it's actually quite cool because it's a, a large area to charge on your face and imagine you have to tape 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 and you know go all over your face this one just easy just go around circular motion just one or two seconds down so I like to be easy so this one would be something I recommend for you also for cushions and um, these guys come with different sun protection so I think he, uh, yeah, Lancome and also Kinect uh, one, they come with SPF 50. So these would be for you if you after something high impact, you know, for the actual sun protection. But still, even though it's quite high, it doesn't mean like you have to work, you can't wear them hold it without touch up. So normally I would suggest if you expose yourself in the sun after four hours, you have to, and no matter what, otherwise you get burned. Uh, sometimes it's like digging darker color is not really a big issue. The worst part is like getting your skin so damaged. And this one comes to SPF 30 and 23. So if you go for a daily life, that'll be totally enough. And also for the um, double wear, this one don't have any SPF. So this one would be quite good. Even like with photos, there was no reflection. So it's quite cool. Basically, that's it. So that'll be the video for today. And thank you so much for watching. Please go through down for the page. You'll find the comments actually area. Let me some comments and see how you like it. Or if you want to see individual one for the actually test, I will do one for you guys as well. And plus, I normally will actually put all the information just down by the, you know, information for the video. So if you go there, you can find all of them as well. Please help me to subscribe my video supporting me and I will update every week with new ideas, with new things for you guys. Thank you so much. We'll see you next time. Bye. Actually, baby, blood time. So let's start with actually our videos here. To be honest, like, this video was formed like two weeks ago. I was planning to do this for a long time. I'll start down there. And then when I edit things, I want to add in more information to it. Not just to put on my face. I wanted to come here with all the different actually areas to feel which one is better and how can I still feel. I try to be really helpful. But unfortunately, when you're adding something, when you're trying to add in more ideas, you'll keep changing in your mind. So basically, it ends up takes two weeks. I haven't got it done yet. I feel so bad as it's been two weeks. I think I'll really update the new video because I actually changed my ear colors, ear styles as well. So, oh my god. Finally, I get it down. Alright, another thing I want to share with you guys is about my cat. You know, like when you have a cat, which is actually babies, they grow up, finally get fat, she's really fat, of course, my baby girl is really fat, and now she don't really move. Finally, someday when you actually see there is actually a white, and also sometimes it's a black one, it's a bird at home. She literally took a fresh bird, I mean, a live bird, home. I don't even know how she made it, but anyway, so she brings it home as a gift for you, and then play, play, play. Like she's playing, you know, the nails right now. So, oh, I, I guess you will know. You never know their life, just like they never understand us anyway. She might be thinking, oh, what happened to my mommy? She's talking to something that's not moving me. Oh, it's just microphone. Yeah. Anyway, life is short. We have to be pretty. We have to keep nice moods. So please, feel free to talk to me.
find me on Facebook or maybe Instagram or even anything else. Yeah, let's be friends. Thank you so much guys for watching my videos and subscribe to my channel for supporting me. It's all because of your help as actually supporting me to move on to do better videos. Alright, shall we see? Let's see. We'll talk about it next time. Yeah, yeah.